What up, what up, what up? It is your boy, Odie Tarantino TV, coming to you guys live today with a brand new video. Welcome back to the channel. Today, we have another epic episode of Storytime with Tino. <clears throat> I told you guys I love this series because it really gives me a chance to go back to a certain point in my life where I was young, naive, and I was just doing anything and everything. You know, some stuff happened that was funny, some stuff happened that was painful, but, you know, that's what this series is about. Just learning a little more about me exploring what I've been through. As you guys see on the screen today, we're going to be using a CUDA, and, oh my god, let me tell you guys, I I was literally sitting here watching some of Scumpy's old videos when he used to just pop down with the CUDA, and one thing I noticed is that he put a suppressor on it, but me... I know that the CUDA has somewhat of a low fire rate compared to like the VMP and the Weevil. So I put rapid fire on it and it, oh my God, it absolutely melts kids. I'm trying to tell you, if you want to try this class out, I really recommend it. But I only recommend it if you have headsets because of course you're, you only have one perk three so it's either you play with blast suppressor or you play with dead silence me i'd rather play with blast suppressor because i wall run a lot and i don't want anybody just having to see me ping on the outside wall run if i'm trying to fuck some shit up so other than that let's get right into the video So today's video will be playing KC as you guys can see, but today's video will mainly be about my very first backflip. Now, most people are thinking, you know, what's 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 so big about a backflip? Well, I will tell you what was so big about this specific backflip because it wasn't intentional. It was never supposed to happen. So anyway, let's get right into the video. So I'm about eight years old, and me and my older sister, she's like. Like 10 11 she's about 10 or 11 and we were just at the park playing around you know having laughs and jokes haha -ha, whatever so out of nowhere we um we just went to the playground just walking around playing and you know i'm on the slide i'm having my fun i'm just minding my little business so we get on the seesaw right get on the seesaw Everything is cool. Nothing bad happened. So we go to the seesaw. You know, she, she's up, I'm down. I'm down, she's up. We just seesaw, blah, blah. Have a laugh, having fun. So I'll go back to the slide. Sometimes I go to the swing. I'm just, I'm really just young. I'm having fun. I'm having the time of my life, basically. And my sister has to leave. So I, I didn't get upset. I just more or less got a little like, you know confused like why'd you leave so she just walks into the house i stayed at the playground because you know the playground was like right across the street from our house so it wasn't like it was unsafe for me to be there so i go to the playground i'm just chilling out cooling next thing you know i'm on the seesaw standing up on the seesaw with like just looking at the fucking word i was there next thing i know i'm in the air sky high looking at the sky but nothing happened. I just went straight up in the air. So I'm like, yeah, cool. That was fun. Let's do that again. But we did it again. Same thing happened. Did it again. Same thing happened. Why on the absolute fourth fucking time? I guess I was in the wrong place. I guess she came down too hard. My ass gets launched into the air. But my body starts rotating. So I'm going into this backflip motion. And I'm like, oh shit. I'm in the air. I'm I'm upside down. This is this is not supposed to be it. I'm supposed to just be going straight up. What the fuck? So I come down. I'm like, nah, this is okay. This is okay. I land straight on my feet. And I'm like, oh shit. God damn. I did a for I, I did a backflip. So you know, kid I'm I'm a kid. I'm young. I'm stupid. I didn't know that, you know, 
maybe they maybe that wasn't supposed to happen anyway so we do it again i did another backflip i'm just fucking shit at this point i'm like yeah i did my first backflip i'm i'm hype right now like let's let's get over let's, let's get at me so we did the fourth you know accidental backflip and i guess i didn't have enough momentum going backwards and i fucked my shit up I literally cannot lie to you guys. I fucked my shit up. I landed on my head so fucking hard that I went home to my grandmother crying with the world's fattest knot on my head. Like, you can literally see my head from like two miles away how fat the knot was. It was, oh my god, it was fucking scary. I didn't like it. So, I'm sitting here walking around my motherfucking town with a fat ass knot on my head sitting here wondering like okay what the fuck why do i got a knot on my head it was just so ugh and then what's so bad is that my grandmother didn't even feel bad for me she was like you're not dying you're still here you're still alive i'm like i'm like what i have a knot on my head the size of a fucking melon and you're just sitting here telling me oh you're okay no, I'm not okay. So she literally we go to the patient first, and we go to the patient first. They were like, okay, nothing bad happened. You know, you don't have a concussion. You don't have any mild brain trauma going on. You're fine. So I'm like, but I had this knot on my head. Like, what are you gonna do about that? And they was like, oh, that's fine. Just ice it. I'm like, ice it. This shit hurts to touch it. I'm not putting no. I'm not doing shit. So I literally walked around. You know, with school and shit for literally like three, four fucking days with this fat ass knot on my head before I decided, you know what, it doesn't hurt anymore. I can fucking, I can put some ice on this shit. Bruh. That was probably the worst thing I could have ever done. Because as soon as I go to touch it, ha! I'm, I'm just pulling back at me. Ha! 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 You know, just say, touch, ha! Touch, ha! Touch, ha! Like, I, I can't touch this fucking knot. It, it's that painful. I don't even want to look at it. So my grandmother gives me a break. Finally, she lets me just stay home from school. Um, with the bad ass knot on my head. But she was like, just keep ice on it. Because you ain't trying to miss too many days of school. I milk this shit so hard. I'm trying to tell you. I literally milk it. I literally sit at home. For about four or five days. With a bad ass knot on my head. Eating soup ice cream sob stories all kinds of shit bro i was oh my god i was i was just chilling chilly yen so there you go i know the story was a little shorter than usual but i couldn't remember that much details about it but i you know i try to put in what I knew I remember. I didn't want to, you know, fabricate a story to make it seem nice. I wanted to give you guys the full details. But I hope you guys did enjoy this video. As you guys can see, we are playing some KC in the background. I joined this game pretty late, like two six when I joined. And as you guys can see, I got my full score streak three times. So obviously, I turned up for the family. I don't even know if I died more than twenty times. I know I had like thirty-three confirms and some shit like that. Get turned on, baby. So yeah, you guys just sit here and enjoy the rest of the gameplay, and I'll catch you guys in the next video. Until next time, be blessed. Friendly GI unit deployed. Friendly ramp deploy ship inbound. Hostile counter UAV above. Radar is down. Hostile
hostile HCXD in your AO. The wind's in sight. Stay on target. Mission objective met. Prep for evac. Positive. Optimal outcome achieved.